Hi everybody, it's Joe Kirk from FinSuite. In this video, we go over the FinSuite CMS library for Webflow. We're in the live example going over the tabs component. In this video, we learn how to add interactions to your dynamic tabs component with CMS library. You are going to be able to apply native Webflow interactions to your tabs. This video is only covering those interactions and if you don't know how to set up the tabs with CMS library, please go back to example one where we go over this in full. This video is only about correctly applying the interactions. First, let's go over the tab change interaction that we have as an element trigger. Inside of our native tab component, if we select one of the tab links and then go to element trigger, we'll see tab change be something that can be selected. And if we go to tab change, we are going to be able to apply an interaction when a tab comes in and when a tab goes out. So we have this set up as we want, all looking great. And we have something on out. And what we really need to know here is that this must be applied on the class level, not the element level. You can see here, this is applied to the class, not the element. If we only did it on the element, when we generate our new tabs and our new tab panes, this is not going to work. But if we apply it to the class level, when we go and generate our new tabs, these will be applied to those new tabs. Excellent. And now when we go to our tabs, this is copy to tab we can go in here and we'll see our interaction example of this moving avocado. Awesome. Now, same thing, we have to go and apply this to the class level, not the element level. If it's the element level, when we create these new elements in the page, they won't get this effect. So we apply to the class level and everything is going to work. Now let's go to the live example and let's make sure this is actually working. Here we'll go to project three and project four all the way through here. So this is working exactly as we want with the hover effect. Great, that is how you apply interactions to your dynamic tabs component with CMS library. That's effing sweet.